So good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Ray and I have the pleasure of conducting the marriage ceremony this afternoon. May I begin by extending a very warm and sunny welcome to you all here today on behalf of Ben and Tasha to the beautiful rustic charms of the Old Swan and Minster Mill, the scene for the celebration of their marriage. I have to tell you that this venue was chosen after extensive research by the two of them. Um, the, the number of sites visited is uh, up, for, up for question, but I've got here 20 venues in all. So we do hope that you enjoy your visit here today. And it means a lot to both Ben and Tasha that you, their family and friends, are here to witness their wedding vows and celebrate their marriage. Tasha, I knew I loved you from the moment we first met. You are the love of my life and very soon to be my wife. I promise to make my life forever yours and build my dreams around you. I promise to be the man you see today, tomorrow and for always. I vow to always protect you from harm, to stand with you against your troubles and look to you when I need protection. I promise to listen to your advice and occasionally take it. I promise to sometimes let you win, even though you believe you do through your own efforts. I promise to always include you when Chelsea are playing oh, or when the F1 is on. <laughs> but my promise to you is this. I give you my unconditional love, tenderness and undying devotion to not ask you to be more than you are and to love you for being you, the perfect wife for me. This marriage ceremony marks the start of a new chapter in their adventure together. You are all part of Ben and Tasha's lives and they have brought you all here together to celebrate this day with them, to share in their happiness and to witness their wedding vows. They thank you all for travelling here today, wherever you have travelled from, and we hope that today is a happy occasion for all of you. Ben, I've known you for nine years of my life and now I stand in front of you about to become your wife. You and I both know how indecisive I can be, but this is one decision I know is right. I promise I will save you when you cannot stay afloat, and if your tears can fill an ocean, then I will be your boat. I promise I will love you when the world doesn't love you back, and no matter what struggles or tra challenges lie ahead of us, I choose you to be by my side. Through all of the ups and downs, together we make the perfect path. You will forever be my always, when I want you when I'm sad. And though there may be times I tell you otherwise and drive you a bit mad, please listen, hug and comfort me and remember how happy we are today. I vow for us to never stop being weird because it makes us laugh and feel at home. I promise to never stop loving you. Not having you with me is something I'll always fear. I promise to be willing to face change and trust that we will always be there for each other. I'm so excited to start our new journey as a husband and wife. Now they first met back in 2010 on their first date in Windsor, which is now one of their favourite places, when Ben asked Tasha out while sitting on, the inverted commas, their bench outside Windsor Castle at sunset. Now we did contact Windsor Council, but they would not let us bring the bench here today, so I'm sorry, <laughs> sorry Ben. But then we fast forward five years to 2015 and a romantic proposal by Ben down by the river, and you guessed it, Windsor, at sunset was duly accepted by Tasha. And that's the reason we're all here today is because of that decision. So once in a lifetime you find someone who touches not only your heart, but also your soul. Once in a lifetime you discover someone who stands beside you, not over you. Once in a lifetime you find someone who loves you for who you are, and not for who you could be. And once in a lifetime you find someone as Ben and Tasha have found each other. Ben and Tasha, you have both made the declarations prescribed by law and have made a solemn and binding contract with each other in the presence of your witnesses here assembled. It therefore gives me the greatest privilege and honour to announce that you are now husband and wife together. You might want to celebrate this moment by sharing a kiss. 